What's up everybody? Today we're going to be getting into this Gundam build. This Gundam is the RX-10 4FF Penelope Manovsky Flight System Mobile Suit. Uh, a lot of word salad, but this is, uh, I've been, I've had this, I've been holding on to this Gundam for about a month now. I've been putting it off strictly because I know, I knew how big it was going to be, but I really, honestly, I underestimated how much of a, of a chore this build was going to be. But all in all, it's still fun. It's always fun building these things. And before we actually get into like the, the time lapse and everything, I just want to shout out the Drum Dojo for whipping together this, uh, this scenic background music that we have going on i'll go ahead and link his channel in the description yeah i ended up uh spending two different days on this build and all in all is somewhere like five or six hours to to get this thing completed but yeah we'll get into the time lapse so you can watch it This build was definitely pretty intimidating. The, the instructions themselves were pretty much a fat chapter book. So just getting into it, I knew it was going to be a, a long night this night that I was working on it. And I, once I had the actual framework of the Gundam built, I just decided to pause it there because it, it seemed like a good stopping point. And honestly, at this point, this is what you'd expect. Just a, a normal, everyday uh, Gundam. So it was interesting to know, like, just a, a side note, I was like maybe a third of the way through the actual build book, so I knew that there's a whole lot more to come. And then I ended up doing the second half about a week later just because I had so much stuff going on with work and, and whatnot. Throughout this time lapse, you'll just see this guy like slowly overtake the entire screen because just how massive he was. So I ended up at the end of it, I just moved him to the side. Yeah, this thing is massive. It stands somewhere around a foot, honestly. And all the little additions on top of the Gundam himself is is pretty much like building a second Gundam on top of the original Gundam. This is by far the biggest. Uh, Gundam build or any build that I've done for any other anything else I ended up sticking with just the cannon blasters on the shoulders and not building any of the the weapons that he came with Strictly because there's so much going on with this thing that it, it felt like it is a lot cleaner to just do, go that route And there, uh, there he is next to the original, or there he is next to the the Gundam that I built in the previous video. So you can just see the the massive size difference. Anyway, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And let me know what you think about this Gundam. And if you would like to see more Gundam builds in the future, because I definitely enjoy doing this, and it's a lot of fun.